Hi, gotcha! No, I didn't see that. I should have seen that coming ages ago. Cheeky little monster. And isn't it always you that says success is, is in, in the, the details? details. <laughs> oh, well, it's time for me to attend to some other details. Well, we may laugh, but it's true. Details are what make the difference. Sometimes even between making a profit and just breaking even. You have to pay attention to the details as part of your strategy for success. Do you want to join me? Just like chess. I mean, take things like liners and tubes. <laughs> they look pretty insignificant till something goes wrong, and then suddenly you're really crying over spilt milk. But having a split tube or ruptured liner aren't the only problems. They're just the most obvious ones. Long-term implications of worn-out rubber parts can be severe. The detergents and milk fat speed up the aging process of rubber. Then it swells, gets harder, and surface cracks form, which is where the bacteria develop and threaten other health, which is when half your herd get mysteriously sick. Dalaval have done their research, as usual, and proved that regular replacement of liner and tubing can increase my profitability through improved udder health, more effective milking, and better quality milk. New liners are more flexible and elastic than old ones. They actually make the milking process more agreeable for the cows. It's more like being suckled by a calf. Replacing liners regularly ensures better teat massage and stimulates higher productivity. Actually, since I started the replacement program with my local De Laval service engineer, I've noticed an increase in milk yield and a downturn in somatic cell count, SCC, and total bacteria count. <laughs> Should have started earlier. Knowing when to replace the parts is the tricky thing. Half the damage is invisible. So I go by the De Laval recommendation. They use the best rubber, approved for food contact, and I know their parts will do the best job for the longest time. Most people think farming is about routine. I think it's about how you cope with the unpredictable. All you can do is plan your strategy for success and then deal with what comes along. Dalaval say it pays to replace in time, and I reckon they're right. I regularly replace all the rubber parts because it gives me a certain peace of mind about the comfort of my cows and the quality of the milk. Makes me feel I'm one step ahead of the game. Which is more than you can say for my strategy in this game. Thank <laughs> you. 